hey guys welcome back to my channel so if you're new please click subscribe and if you're regular welcome back so in this video i'll be talking about the back end essentials everything you know, need to know about the back end so firstly you need to know the programming languages proficiency in at least one of the languages java python ruby etc understanding of programming um, concepts like data structures algorithms and oop then database management you need the knowledge of database systems such as my sql mongodb sql server just to name a few you need the ability to design and optimize database schemas write sql queries and understand database normalization and then the next thing you need to know your web development frameworks like django spring express.js ruby on rails laravel and asp.net to name a few you also need the knowledge of apis understanding of restful and or graph ql apis ability to design develop and consume apis for communication from the back end to the front end version control systems like we i said on my front end for collaboration web servers and deployment you need the knowledge of web servers like apache or nginx and deployment platforms like aws heroku or, or google cloud platform understanding of containerization <laughs> technologies such as docker um, for application de deployment and management and then security awareness of um, common security practices and vulnerabilities such as sql injection cross-site scripting and techniques to mitigate them understanding of authentication and authorization mechanisms like jwt and oauth and then testing and debugging proficiency in writing tests and integration tests for backend ability to debug and troubleshoot backend systems effectively and then continuous integration or continuous development cic excuse me Knowledge of CI CD pipelines um, for automation of build, test, and deployment processes, and familiarity with tools such as Jenkins, Travis CI, or Circle CI, to name a few, and problem solving abilities and attitude towards the task given. And then additional skills are knowledge of catching mechanisms, that is Reddit, Redis, and Catch for optimizing application performance and then familiarity with microservices architecture and container orchestration tools like kubernetes experience with serverless computing platforms like aws lambdas or google cloud functions and then like the other video continuous learning so that's all for back-end essentials i hope you are enjoying the mini series and i hope you do it does help you in some way so that's all for the video please give this video a thumbs up comment down Comment down below and do subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed. Until the next one. Bye guys.